Hello, I would like to have a boarding pass, please. Sure. Um, can I have your passport, please? Yes. Or an ID? Here's my passport. Thank you. Just give me a second, please. Of course. I need to scan it. Okay. Um, you got your boarding pass via the app. Uh, I cannot print it out anymore. Yeah. Um, do you want to check in any bags? Uh, no, not any bags. Okay, great. Thank um, you. You have to go now to security. Oh, thank you. Bye. Bye. Hi and good morning plane spotters and aviation lovers. I'm Star Plane Spotter and today I'm in Paris, a very lovely city to visit. Also, I'm going to fly Czech Airlines for the first and last time. What do I mean about last? Well, today the airline is going to serve its final flight and I'm going to be one of the passengers on board. As soon as I heard about the news of the final flight, I booked it immediately. It cost me 3,532 Czech Krona, which is $127.03. I also bought a seat, which cost me $6.29. The reason why Czech Airlines is going bankrupt is because of financial crisis, the COVID-19 pandemic, and other problems. It also started a partnership with Smartwings, which means that Smartwings will take over the airline after the last flight. Czech Airlines was founded on October 6, 1923. They had many different types of aircraft, a Ilesian, Tupolev, Airbus, Boeing, and ATR. And now I made it to Charles de Gaulle Airport. This is crazy. Of course they put Christmas decorations on October. How early do, do they want to have Christmas decorations? I mean, it's crazy. Two months left until Christmas. Let's go. I'm also with two friends who will join me on this flight. Let's see what they have to say about it. Alan, hi. It's Samuel, hi. How do you feel for the last flight in Czech Airlines? So in my opinion, it's something very sad because it's actually one of the oldest airlines in all of the aviation industry. It's uh, the first old, fourth oldest in all the world, 101 years of history. So it's going to be for sure something very sad and uh, also memorable. I absolutely agree with Alan, it's very sad, it's the fifth oldest airline. I mean, I'm pretty excited to fly on this flight, but also in the same way very sad because obviously it's the last flight. Did you fly Czech Airlines uh, back in the days when you were a child? So, uh, unfortunately when I was a child I always used to fly Smartwing, so the partner of Czech Airlines and uh, I flew Czech just a few times a few months back, so no, nothing. So for me, I did fly a lot of Czech Airlines, so it's quite very memorable for me. Do you think uh, this uh, last flight will be very special, like they will give you um, free food, airplane models, something like that? It's a very good question and I have no idea. Same as someone we honestly don't know, but maybe they might give us some, some, good, some bags with some goodies in there, but there's not, nothing sure. I at least saw on a story on Instagram printed out papers with written on it with pictures also. I'm not sure. Um, I have really no expectations. This is a question that has three options. If you had the chance, what would you bring back? Air Berlin, Czech Airlines or Concorde? Czech Airlines 100%. Probably Czech Airlines I would say because it's obviously the oldest one and it's older than uh, Air Berlin and I would say it's also cool with the Concorde, but um, I would say Czech Airlines is way cooler. From scale of 1 to 10, how much excited are you for the last flight? I can't say 10 because it's the last flight, but yes, I'm very excited. I would say 8 out of 10, but I agree with Alan. Who I am here today? I'm Andy, and uh, in Instagram they call me Star Plane Spotter. What is your expectations for this last flight of Czech Airlines? I never flew a Czech Airlines before and I don't know how it is. I, I still haven't seen any YouTube videos about trip reporters trying Czech Airlines, so I have no clue how it is. So what do you really expect to happen on that flight? I mean, it's the last flight, so I hope uh, before we board the plane they will give us these uh, bags with gifts and then uh, in the middle of the flight they can also try to give us airplane models and I don't mind if they give us airplane models for a competition or something like that, uh, we'll see. You have no history with Czech Airlines. Did you heard in the past something about Czech Airlines? I heard about Czech Airlines before and I know it's the flag carrier of uh, Czech Republic. I never flew it and I never seen any videos. Thank you for the interview. Thank you. Do you have a six? 
No, go fish. After playing cards with my friends, we happen to see Josh Cahill in the same gate as ours. He's going to fly with us too. Hello guys, uh, I'm with Josh and uh, it's a great opportunity to see you. I always wanted to uh, meet a trip reporter who has... Uh, uh, how, many, how many subscribers do you have? Like one million? Almost, almost getting there. What do you want to tell the people who are a little bit shy to be on YouTube and on Instagram? Just take the camera, just follow your passion, you know, if you like genuinely believe in something and something gets you excited, you know, it's always awkward, especially in the beginning. I've been there, everyone's been there, everybody started with zero subscribers. After some time, you get more, a lot more comfortable, you know, just go out there and try. Go on airlines that excite you, and once you get excited and you have that that passion in you, it is just all going by itself. Eventually, it will just work out for you, and I'm sure it will for you as well. Yeah, you heard him. Thanks, uh, it's a great uh, time for, to meet you. And you should definitely go to Iran and yeah. cover uh, Iranian airlines because they go really well on YouTube. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I will Absolutely. surely do that next year. Hello. Hi, hello. Okay, I'm so sorry. Thank you for flying with us for Thank the last you. time. <laughs> Hello. Hello, good evening, welcome board. Thank you. Please fasten your seatbelts. We will show you how to close the buckle, how to tighten the belt, and this is how to open it again. Please study these safety cards carefully before departure. Thank you.
After takeoff, the cabin crew started serving pre-ordered meals. Since a lot of passengers were standing in the cabin, the service got slow. It took around one hour for the crew to serve. After that, they started serving a tea and coffee service, but they only managed to do that for 25% of the passengers since the seatbelt sign turned on. So the funny thing is that I was waiting to order a meal the whole flight, so I technically wasted my time because I wanted to join the back alley with the aft gigs and take some pictures. But we're descending right now, so we can just enjoy the last landing of CSA. Cabin crew, arrive in position. Our flight was on top 1 for the most tracked flights in Flight Radar 24. I also heard that over 40,000 people tracked us, which was crazy to know. We also had a chance to listen to the final announcement from the flight crew, which made me feel sad. Ladies and gentlemen, our crew says goodbye to you. We hope that you enjoyed today's flight with us as much as we did. On behalf of Czech Airlines, we thank you from the bottom of our hearts for the loyalty you have shown us over the past 101 years. Flying for you has been our honor and privilege, and we hope that every of your future flights where you see our colors will always be okay. Thank you and good night. Almost, after almost uh, 101 years, uh, the last flight of Czech Airlines landed here. And on behalf of all kind and former employees of Czech Airlines, I would like to thank you, our passengers, for always trusting us and boarding our planes with a sense of security and safety, which we provided to you with pride and love. In the turbulent 20th century, Czech Airlines was able to survive all the historical epochs and twists that the Czech Republic and Slovakia went through, starting the difficult beginnings of the air transport in the 20s and 30s, surviving period of occupation, socialism in the wild 90s, and subsequent difficult period characterized mainly by the fight against terrorism and global pandemic. Unfortunately, history and tradition were overpowered by the decision of the company's owners to terminate the company operating license and thus the actual termination of operations under OK brand to the date. Thank you very much for flying Czech Airlines today and I wish you a peaceful evening. Bye bye. a bylo velkým potěšením uh, s vámi dnes letět. Děkujeme, krásný večer. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much. It was a great pleasure for us to fly with you today on today's flight. Have a good evening and thanks again.
I was also expecting that the crew would give us passengers a gift bag, airplane models and other stuff for an AF gig to keep, but we didn't get anything from them. Even the pilots didn't draw anything in the sky, they just drew a straight line behind us. We also didn't have a water salute, which was very weird to me, because I know every airline that made its final flight, like Air Berlin, got a water salute. Even if an airline captain retires, they will also get a water salute. So I was disappointed that we didn't get any water salute. But I was so happy to be a part of history and get a chance to try an airline before getting bankrupt. Thank you Czech Airlines. You will be missed, but not forgotten. And how do you feel like, uh, how do you, how you, oh, sorry. Well, I guess I officially have a cameraman now. How much do I have to pay for him? It's 20 euro, 20 euro an hour. <laughs> yes. I'm broke. No. But you have more cameras than I have. <laughs> yeah, I mean this is the, my main camera and this is an extra camera. In case this gets broken, I can use this one.